السلام علیکم ویورس کیسے ہیں آپ سب آئی ہوپ آپ سب خیریت سے ہوں گے تو چلیے ویڈیو کو اسٹارٹ کرتے ہیں آج ہم واٹر فورٹ آئر سٹی کے بارے میں بتائیں گے آپ کو واٹر فورٹ فرام اولڈ نارتھ میننگ ڈیم از اے سٹی ان کاؤنٹی واٹر فورٹ ان دا ساؤتھ ایسٹ آف آئر لینڈ اٹ از لوکیٹڈ ود ان دا پروونس آف منسٹر دا سٹی از سچویٹڈ At the end, uh, head of Waterford Harbour, it is the oldest and the fifth most popular city in Ireland. It is the ninth most popular settlement. Settlement on the island of Ireland, Waterford City and County Council is the local government authority for the city. According to the 2016 census, 53,504 people live in the city with a wide metropolitan population of 82,963. Today, Waterford is known for Waterford Crystal, a legacy of the city former glass making industry. Glass or crystal was manufactured in the city from 1783 early 2209 when the factory there was shut down after the receivership of Waterford. The Waterford Crystal Visitor Center in the Viking Quarter and under the new owners opening in June 2010 after the intervention of waterford city council and waterford chamber of commerce and resumed production waterford is also known for being through the starting point of a uh, first site first wife a uh, fort 14 seat air uh, aircraft flying between waterford and london The name Waterford from uh, Old Norse, uh, the Irish name is Port, meaning a large port, Wiccans, Radiance, first establishment, uh, first established uh, a settlement near Waterford in 853 it, and all the other long ports who, who ventured in 1903. And uh, after that, uh, by uh, Ragnar U. A. Emir and uh, the U. L. Emir dynasty and built what would Ireland's first city among the most prominent rules of Waterford as was Ivar of. Uh, in 1167, Dynamic to fail in an attempt to take Waterford, he returned in 11, uh, 1170 with Cambro Norman mercenaries under Richard on cleared second Earl of Pem- uh, Pembroke. Together they reside and took the city after a desperate defense in uh, furtherance of the Norman uh, in, uh, invasion of Ireland. Landed at uh, Waterford in 1171, Waterford and uh, then Tubalian was uh, declared royal cities, with Tubalian also declared the capital of Ireland. Throughout the medieval period, uh, Waterford uh, was Ireland's second city after Dublin in the 15th century, Waterford replied to the pretenders to the English throne and burning as a result gave the city into motto. After the present reformation, Waterford remained a Catholic city and participated in the confederation of Kilne and independent Catholic government from 1642 to 1649. This was ended abruptly by Oliver Cromwell was who brought the country back under English rule his son-in-law Henry VIII and finally took Waterford In 1650 after a major siege in 1690 during the Williamator by was the Jacquard Irish army who forced to surrender Waterford in the wake of the battle of the Boyne The 18th century was a period of huge prosperity for Waterford. Most of the city's best architecture appeared during his time. A permanent military presence was established, uh, established in the city with the completion of the cavalry tracks. At the end of the 18th century, in the early 19th century, Waterford city was deceived and ruled and the British government erected on the Hook Peninsula to reference. The existing fort and the Nakanon during the 19th century great industries such as glass making and ship building thrived in the city. 
This city was represented in the Parliament of the United Kingdom from uh, 1891 to 1918 by John Ribbon. Up to till it na hi milte hain next video mein ek aur Irish city ke saath. Ab ta khayal rakhein. Allah.